Hello guys and welcome to episode 20 of my Medieval 2 Total War campaign playing as England on very hard difficulty. Today we're continuing after taking Cairo off the Egyptians and completing the Crusade. We're going to try and obviously just hold that now until we can uh, get together an army to attack Alexandria. I will also be spreading out some more merchants and priests and stuff from there. And I think we already have a priest lined up. Yes, we do. Let's jump over to Europe. And we have our Orders. faction leader ready to attack Marseille by the looks of things. However, there is actually this Spanish army here. Where did that come from? Come face me. We Got dismounted feudal dead. knights in it. It's not good. What can I build here? Just one dismounted feudal knight. I guess we'll have to in order to defend. I could send some troops on the way back to Toulouse. Maybe I could send the mercs back. I'm not sure how much we're going to need here. Let's have a scout around because I swear there was another army here somewhere. God speak. I am spent, sire. I shall continue tomorrow. I don't think there was. Continuing once okay. I have rest. So we should be able to split this. Let's My lord Probably lead the charge with King Rufus. My lord. I think Orders. what I'm going to do is actually bring Sire. my mercenary spearmen to my the lord. attack on Marseille, just so that they don't Sire. become rebels. Orders. My lord. Orders. Alright, and then we're going to send the rest back. Entering woods and preparing to ambush, my lord. Hopefully, Orders. these won't become rebels. Orders. We should to be war, able to siege or even yes, assault sire. Marseille. Receiving it looks like our enemy. spy has followed through with his attempt to open the gates, which is really good. So we may as well just assault it. I don't think there's a very big garrison here. 41 men. Can we auto-resolve this or not? Tempted to try. Okay, thank God. <laughs> Took a bit of a gamble there. But uh, it paid off. We only lost 62 men, which I'll, I'll, I can take. I can deal Glorious with that. Glorious victory is ours, sire. As you commanded, sire, these lands are now yours. I think I'm going to just occupy this. Doesn't actually like us too much, so let's just lower the tax and we'll start to build the church there. Although saying that, I should probably afford myself some more troops in Toulouse. So let's get some longbowmen. And I'll get some billmen, I think. Trouble is, they don't get armor here, so they're not actually going to be that good against the armored knights. Like dismounted feudal knights at least. It really depends Name what's in this Spanish army, but will, I reckon they'll get start. aggressive regardless. We do have a couple units of armored swordsmen finishing here this turn, which is nice. So yeah, this army is probably going to have to clean up this lot, go back to Angers, go back to Khan. Khan's going to have I access fight. to these uh, catapults, because we got these in the last episode. Orders. Just remember them. My Lord. So let's put them onto yes, the boats. Sir. I think we're just going to go into dock yes, for now. Full sails. Then we'll have the army Orders. come out and go Sire. to Khan. So we should have an army that can deal with that rebellion. Over in the Holy Roman Empire, we're waiting for this mission to wear off. And down with the Pope. Your we're just chilling. What is it you would discuss with me? They do like us quite a lot, don't they? So maybe we could offer them like an alliance or something. That would be cool. Never mind. Um, I think Farewell, I'll just cancel that for now. Don't have any money to give them. How much money do we get in the next turn? 7,800. That's not too bad, actually. Any merchants that need moving out of these settlements? I don't think there is. We're all good. Let's carry on. Actually, let's service. not carry on because this merchant here, I just remembered, has not been doing anything for a very Who long time. Business shall we take then, sire? Seizing enemy and that was what I had intended orders, to do, and sire. he was successful, Opening which is fantastic. Lane, That's actually given us more money. 
Okay. So where do we invest that then? Uh, we can probably maybe get some another unit of dismounted feudal knights at Angers would be a good idea. And the remainder, I think we'll go towards Marseille. I wanted to build that small church, didn't I? We should also fix up the stone wall, actually. That's pretty important to do. We'll get that done first. And I'll start to build the town hall. Just so that we get the extra public order bonus due to health. Or due to law, sorry. Sire. Oh. There is a French army here. My armor with your I think I baited myself with this priest. We should be able to hold. In None theory, it doesn't look could best me, that good. Let's have a look. It will what be units a good does he have? Oh, that's fine. Okay, I thought it would be more infantry. But it's quite a lot of blisters, so that's okay. I'm not too worried anymore. I think we're going to just say hello to this priest. Okay, that worked out nicely. That's actually leveled him up twice. Yeah. So now we should be able to jump into settlements much easier. So that's what we're going to do next turn. Really have to remember where all of these agents are. <laughs> They're just scattered all over the place. Maybe we can get peace. No. Without right. question, sire. Yes, sire. There is an imperial army on the way. Spotted. I'm such a what gave me away. The accent. We have two imperial assassins that have turned dead. up. We need to kill Name those. Thy target, sire. Rest assured, sire. He Otherwise, they're going to be really thing. annoying. Now is everything done? There is always so much to look at in medieval. I think we are fine. Let's click and turn. Hope for the best. I think our merchant moved in England. That's what we saw. My lord, we're besieged. Oh wow, Toulouse is actually under siege. They've actually done it. Will we have enough men to defend that? I guess it really depends what the troops are. It could just be a bunch of spearmen and some dismounted feudal knights. Ooh. Swordsmith Guild. Very nice. That could be really, really useful. Improves the standard weaponry of standing armies. We have a mission to cease hostilities with France. Your reputation with the Pope will not be as high as it once was, which kind of sucks, but doable. New mission, spread the word of the Lord from the Pope. The Pope sees that the unbelievers in the settlement are clouding the judgment of the righteous. Send a priest to convert at least 17% of the population. Well, we already are doing that, so we should get that mission complete quite easily. Cardinal died from Denmark, and the Cardinal died from Milan. Okay, does that give us any more Cardinals? No. It was a... Oh, there's three empty seats. Okay. Toulouse is under siege. And a lot of buildings complete, which is nice. And we have a lot of troops finished. Okay, so I think I'm just going to forget about these guys. Uh, we're going to go up to Angers. Yes. It's pretty important that we deal with this rebel army sooner than later. So let's just grab them all. And uh, we'll come on out. We have marched our limit today, sire. I'm actually going to get uh, some more of those in here. As well as some more peasants just to stay there. Ships ready. We're going to get these shore, catapults My Lord. into Khan. By your command. Dock is cheap. There is a rebel Come army there. Me. Not that it really matters to us. Sire. Probably just as well that I sent these guys back. What do they have? See you dead. Oh, Shibu. I cannot see. Orders. Hmm. Marching to war. Now can I see? Ouch. 
That's four units of dismounted feudal knights. Eesh. Okay. Um, and then a bunch of these javelin men, which have really high missile attack and melee attack, actually. They've got decent defense as well. I didn't realize these were actually that good. Okay. Well, with the garrison in tow, we should be okay. So let's go ahead and uh, fight this on the battle map. Yes, my lord. Preparing the men to attack. This could actually go wrong, but if I cycle charge the cavalry enough, then I should be fine. They should be able to kill off the ranged forces quite easily, at least. We seem to have a nice hill. Oh, did I turn off AI for the reinforcements? I don't think I did. This is going to suck. Oh dear. Maybe it won't be so bad. Oh, okay, I've got control of them, thank god. <laughs> that could have been really bad. Are they just backing off? They are. Right, I guess we'll just wait for our men to arrive. If they want to come towards us and charge us, then that might suck, but until then, we're just going to chill. Because I can take advantage of my range, I think. I do have more range than they do. So no rush. We can just have our front line get ready. I'll have the Levy Spearman on the flanks. Although they'll be completely outclassed by dismounted feudal knights. Archers behind. The knights can all probably just sit on the flank. And my general can sort of sit with the rest of the men. What other units do I need to order? I think the billmen and the peasants. I think I might have the billmen on one side and the peasants on the other just to back up the spear. Spearmen. Okay. So I'm just having them walk uphill because otherwise they'll get tired. They're probably going to get tired anyway. Because they are walking uphill. Yeah, you can see that these longbowmen are actually winded. Their army seems to be moving around a lot. But yeah, we can just take this slowly. Wait for my guys to recover from their fatigue. I'm gonna make this uh, a control group, I think. That way I can move the formation forwards and we can just wait. Meanwhile, I think I'm gonna get these horses up to the top here. So that we can charge down onto them when we need to. So I'm just letting this six speed because, again, of fatigue. You can see they are still tired. going to change anytime soon. Doesn't look like it's going to. Right, let's move up a little bit further. If we can get into range with our arrows then. They will be forced to come towards us I think. Yeah, here go the longbowmen. The beauty of longbowmen. Absolutely destroying that unit. Using up quite a lot of ammunition, but it's okay. I think all of these are good kills anyway. And we are killing some of the dismounted feudal knights behind. Maybe get up a bit closer, just so that my other archers might be able to fire.
Also, I kind of want to target the dismounted feudal knights. Though I'm going to take these guys off skirmish, put on guard. Yeah, we need to whittle down the armoured forces with the longbowmen, really, since they do have the piercing ability. A nice amount of damage being done there, which is good. I uh, should probably use some shots onto these ones because the target is larger. We'll hit more men. You're under attack. So we haven't done as much damage as I would have liked, uh, but that's used up all of our ammunition. So again, we're going to have to continue forwards. They're going to end up putting themselves in like a downhill position at this break. Oh shit, okay. This ain't good. Pull back boys. I don't want you to take the javelins in the face. Thank you very much. I want the archers to start attacking them. We should probably just charge forwards, right? Kind of what I'm feeling. Unless my archers can fire without us being fired upon. Alright, let's just charge forwards. I think it's time to just engage. I mean, even if they just fall behind their dismounted feudal knights, I don't really mind. We've already done, like, a ton of damage. We can get the peasants to move around the flanks. I'm going to have the knights now come in. And they will have ample opportunity to run down these men. Okay, that's good. We're kind of fighting them. Intervention by the Almighty. A military downhill here, which is good. From this. Right, where's our calf? Yeah, so we smashed those guys, I think. And we should run into their flanks here. Those guys are straight up dead. Oh, that charge. I think we have utterly crushed them. We're doing a lot of damage very quickly. They do have a lot of damage themselves. But uh, so far so good. Just attack these guys behind, I think. Get the uh, the general nice and close. The enemy are That's a good idea. Bloodied. They have lost half their men. Okay, I'm going to move downhill here. We've pretty For much the moment, destroyed the of battle goes our way. their Let's missile forces. It's nice. And this is going to be an uphill charge, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Good tidings. The enemy general, like the enemy general, flees like the coward he is. Oh, press oh. onward. That works. Break the spirit of his army. That charge actually annihilated them. That is very nice. The enemy army flees the field. Pursue and run them down. Well, what do you know? We won. <laughs> I'm going to continue. I think it's important that I run down these men. Uh, we have more than enough cav to do so. So. We will just make sure that they are non-existent. 
and cannot attack us again. Well, it's amazing how easily horsemen run down units in this game. So this good. is a clear victory that goes to only men of great virtue and valor. Fabulous. So that's utterly crushed that uh Yes. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's crushed that army. Mm. They're gonna accept the that. Is ours, sire. And Captain Jasper, man of honor. Or man of the hour, sorry. He is disloyal. Kind of sucks. Hmm. I guess he should be fine. Command me, sire. We'll get him into the settlement for now. And he actually even got a minus one loyalty from that. Interesting. All right. We'll get these dismounted feudal knights back. Might even go as far to just merge so that I can retrain more units in this turn. Yeah, that's fine. So Toulouse is safe. We've taken Marseille. Got ourselves a new general out of it, which is very nice. Now we're continuing Hail to wait for the king. siege of Dijon. Which may cost us quite a lot of relations with the Pope. Hail my king! Henry here, he has a pretty stacked army. I'm pretty sure we can just aggressively move towards Hamburg. But maybe not that far. I'm going to put him on With the border. Honor, We're going to get a watchtower. Yes, my liege. This tower will keep the reason I'm putting him here lands. is so that we can't get like triple teamed by armies. We're going to wait and bide our time to hit that properly. Because although I could probably win a pretty significant battle with the army that he has, I don't want to risk anything. Now, there's a rather large Egyptian army near Cairo, which we're going to have to watch out for. You have a couple of yes. new priests God's heading sure. south. I might actually go ahead and get myself another one somewhere. Let's get one in Bordeaux. We could also get one in Marseille. And actually, Marseille can build a merchant, which means we can get another one here. We did build a priest. Yes, your highness. Or recruit a priest, I should say. Let's go ahead and get another one here. And I'm actually going to get some archer militia because they'll be free upkeep. But we are full, so I might just have to merge. Yeah, we'll merge. It's fine. Great. We don't normally trade with the enemy. We're in a really, really good position. Look at this trade we've got going on. It must be making us a ton of money. 7,922. Definitely. Orders. Anything else we can do to help us out here. Maybe build some more buildings. Get the market at York. And I might get the brothel at Dublin just to help out with public order. And that will pretty much be everything spent in terms of our cash. Nowhere else that we can really build anything I want. Maybe we could get some more longbowmen from Khan. Your will, sire. Let's do that. Alright, let's end the turn. The other thing we do need to do is pay off the Pope, since uh, we are going to fail the mission again in this turn. Is Milan actually going to offer us something, or are they just trying to bribe our settlements? <laughs> Who knows? Like Egypt's just going to bypass us. Don't think I need a Thieves Guild at Reims, if I'm honest. And mission success. To cease hostilities. Who is that with? 
Uh, that was with the Holy Roman Empire. So very good relations with the Pope. Very nice. Cardinal promoted from Poland. Prince Simon the Crusader got Drillmaster. Plus 25% to movement points. 10% discount on unit training. Pretty good. Pretty good, actually. Let's jump down here. See if we can... Put another merchant in a decent place. At your service. I might challenge this guy. We do not at your service. Only 28% chance of success though. At your service. Let's go and sit on those spices. We'll it might be a bit risky, God's but servant. oh well. Two priests down here that will definitely help things out. I might send one towards Alexandria actually, because this should increase their piety yes, really quickly. Place. Yeah, we did also recruit priests here, didn't we, as well? Because we wanted to send God's them south. Servant. My lord. Okay. These dismounted feudal knights, they actually have increased melee attack. That's cool. Sire, orders. Jump them into the army. And this is a, 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 a very elite army. By your command. My lord. I'm going to try and get the catapults involved, if I can. Orders. Doesn't look That's like I can. Possible, sire. My Lord. Well, we'll just do yes, this. To war, and we shall sire. continue. This is a legit army. <laughs> it could do with more longbowmen. So I think I'm just going to build some more of those. Maybe one more unit of mailed knights, since we don't orders. have much cavalry. My Lord. So yeah, this is our new elite army. And that can go wherever we need it, really. Maybe down to Spain. Because then if we have that army come down south and go to Spain, we could merge the armies from Toulouse and Marseille to go and attack Milan. I'll be polishing my armor with your tabard soon. Yes, your highness. Sire. Right, what next? Where to, sire? Just going to spy on this guy. Watching from the Reason being is I want sire. to just increase his ability of course, otherwise we're going to move on and have a look I at what's about tomorrow. hail my king could we attack Dijon now tempted but I don't think now's the time let's continue to retrain stuff in Metz I'm also going to get some more men here in the form of levy spearmen idea being that we'll eventually attack Stauffen now that the uh Hail mission has king. ended. I am not These armies are looking pretty obnoxious. Fight you wish. Come closer. Don't know what to do about that. Do we have a spy up there here? I don't think Need we do. Someone removed, sir. There was some assassins about. As you will. But we can't see them anymore. On my way. As you will. On my way. Hmm. We actually had a Thieves Guild somewhere, didn't we? If we go into the building browser... Yeah, Paris has the Thieves Guild. So I'm going to get myself another spy. And the reason for that is I want to send it up towards Hamburg. Orders. But I think that's pretty much it. We're at our agent limit of merchants again. These guys can retrain, but I think that's just to upgrade their armor. Let's just merge them. And we'll start to build that church here. Would also be worth getting the ship right, actually, so that we have some extra trade from Marseille. I'm going to get some Spear Militia, because these will have free upkeep anyway. And they will just bolster the amount of men in Marseille, which I think is a good idea. So what next? I know I'm taking this rather slow at the moment, but we do need to make sure that I'm not missing anything. If I do start to miss things, then it can get out of hand very quickly. Like, especially if there was like a large rebel army somewhere up north. 
in Britain that I missed. Will, and then it took a settlement, that would be kind of awkward. Let's move this unit out and down to Reims. It might be a bit risky because they'll probably turn into rebels, but we shall see. As for the remaining 2k, I'm feeling we may as well just build some more units here. We've got a couple of longbowmen and mailed knights. That's going to be three. Then we got space for three more units after that. Which could be some dismounted feudal knights and maybe a couple more longbowmen, honestly. Unless we build stuff elsewhere, like some dismounted feudal knights in Toulouse. Yeah, and we can also retrain the remainder of those units then. Yeah, I think that's good enough. Let's move on to the next turn. Holy Roman Empire might go and try and attack Antwerp, that might happen. I would advise you to listen to Oh this is good. I'm, 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 good. Will be I'm quite happy about that. Although I probably could have tried to no. counter offer it with some money, potentially. Not entirely sure. But that's definitely helpful. It means that they won't attack us for now. Milan hopefully will actually offer me something eventually. <laughs> These animations are just so slow and I have no idea what they're actually trying to do. Could I blockade those men onto that island? I guess maybe I could. Take that marriage, get some more kids, large town ready to upgrade. That is Bruges. Faction announcements, all good. Edinburgh has upgraded. Very nice. Alright, let's get this army together and destroy this rebel army. We do have this Gods priest here that we recruited. Send him down south. I am spent, sire. I shall continue. I think this one's yes, kind of stuck as well. On my way. That's fine. Continuing God's servant. I can continue down to In Marrakesh. I am spent, sire. I shall. Yes, your highness. And these guys are doing a good job over there. Unfortunately, guys, though, it has been my time, so I am going to have to leave it here. This army near Angers is looking absolutely awesome. Cannot wait to use this more. It might even be worth like going back to Angers after this rebel army is defeated and getting the bonus damage on weapons for all of these swordsmen. But that's for next episode. In the meantime, hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.